in my mom and dad room. Yeah. I don't know. The one you did not attend teacher Anne's class yesterday. Yesterday is my grandma home. Ah, you went to your grandma's house. That's why. Okay. Yeah. Okay. How long? Where is your grandma's house? Um, it's quite far. It's not too far. It's the, uh, we are here. We need okay. to. Uh, oh, Whoa, what's <laughs> are here? It's yes. So near. It's not far. Ah, uh, it's not that far. Yeah. Okay, so today we're going to have our listening test. Okay. Yeah, for a while because teacher tried to open. It's very hot today. How about what's the weather in Vietnam? It's very hot too. It's so hot. hot. It's so, f so hot, hot here. Very hot? Yeah, they very sunny. Okay. Yeah, it's very sunny. It's very hot. For a while, just a minute. Uh, Anna, I will just open the window. I am searching our activity, the files. Okay, just a minute. the plate okay after yes oh yeah 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 okay so i will share the screen now this is listening test okay ready ready okay. ready 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 yes <laughs> okay okay i know i'll wait for a while what happened with my Okay, I know you know how to to use computer. Okay. So you have this one. You will have to lessen and draw the line, okay? You lessen and draw the line. Okay, you have to lessen carefully. Okay, Anna? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part one. Yeah. Listen and look. There is one example. So, this is your music club, is it? Yes. Do you want to sit and watch them for a few minutes, Dad? OK. Who is the girl that's playing the drums? That's Sarah. She's good, isn't she? Yes, she is. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. Who is the girl who's dancing? Between the two boys, you mean? Yes. That's Helen. Oh, right. Is that Richard, the boy who's wearing a scarf on his head? There are two boys wearing scarves. The one at the front. The singer? Yes. Yes, that's him. They're not bad, are they? They're all OK, but Michael's excellent. The boy who is playing the guitar? No, the one at the piano. Oh, yes, I know him. I couldn't see his face very well. Does William ever come to the club? Yes, he's here. He's one of our dancers. Which one? He has his hands above his head. Oh, yes, I can see him. Which one do you like best? The girl with the guitar. Is that Emma? Yes. How did you know? Oh, I know her mum and dad. Now listen to part one again. 
Who is the girl who's dancing? Between the two boys, you mean? Yes. That's Helen. Oh, right. Is that Richard, the boy who's wearing a scarf on his head? There are two boys wearing scarves. The one at the front? The singer? Yes. Yes, that's him. They're not bad, are they? They're all OK, but Michael's excellent. The boy who is playing the guitar? No, the one at the piano. Oh, yes, I know him. I couldn't see his face very well. Does William ever come to the club? Yes, he's here. He's one of our dancers. Which one? He has his hands above his head. Oh, yes, I can see him. Which one do you like best? The girl with the guitar. Is that Emma? Yes. How did you know? Oh, I know her mum and dad. That is the end of part one. Okay. Okay, let us see here. Where is Helen? Okay, where is Helen? Helen is this one. Okay, now, what is Helen doing? Okay, you've marked it, but I have to ask question. What is Helen doing? Um, Helen are uh, dancing between is, two boys. It's not R, is Helen is dancing again. Where is Helen? Helen is dancing between two boys. Yeah, dancing between two boys. Oh my God, Helen is dancing. Okay, next one. Where is Richard? Okay, Richard is here. What is Richard doing? Richard is singing. Richard is singing? Yes. Okay, Richard is singing. Number three. Three, number three, please. Number three is... Where is mm. Michael? Okay, what Michael My is doing? Michael playing the piano. Michael is playing the piano. Okay, Michael is playing the piano. Okay, number four. Where is William? Where William. is William? William. Um, William and the boy dancing with his hand. Okay, William. Okay, so here. Mm -hmm. Okay, William is Emma. Okay, William is dancing, waving. His hands. Oh, wow, wow. Oh, wow, wow. <laughs> okay. Next. Where is Emma? What Emma is doing? Emma is playing guitar. Yay. Emma is playing guitar. Oh, my God. Okay. Very good. Great job. Okay. Here. Now, let's move to the next. Okay. You will gonna answer this one again. You will have to listen properly. Part two. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, young man. Do you want to ask me some questions? Yes. I've got to write some things about you for my homework. Well? When I see you on TV, everyone just calls you Betty. Do you have another name? Yes, it's Betty Fountain. That's F-O-U-N-T-A-I-N. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. Right. Now I know, but I don't know how old you are. <laughs> you guess. Mmm, 43? <laughs> no, 57. 
But you look so young. Well, I try to eat the right things. Like what? I usually eat salad, rice and fish. Mmm. Do you live in a big house near the beach, like all the other actors and singers? No. I have a flat in the city and a little house in a village. Oh. What do you do in your holidays? We love sports, so in winter we go skiing and in the summer we go climbing. Who do you go with? I always go on holiday with my husband. Now listen to part two again. Right. Now I know. But I don't know how old you are. <laughs> you guess. Mmm, 43? <laughs> no, 57. But you look so young. Well, I try to eat the right things. Like what? I usually eat salad, rice and fish. Mmm. Do you live in a big house near the beach? Like all the other actors and singers? No, I have a flat in the city and a little house in a village. Oh, what do you do in your holidays? We love sports, so in winter we go skiing and in the summer we go climbing. Who do you go with? I always go on holiday with my husband. Okay. That is the end of part two. What's that? <laughs> okay, husband. Okay, let's see. Okay, listen and write. There is one example. Number one. This famous actress name is Betty Fountain. How old is Betty? She is 57 years old. Yeah. And the food that she eats, she eats salad, rice, and fish. Homes flat in city the house in a village okay and her holidays very good her holidays is okay winter skiing and summer climbing and she is with her husband spelling yeah. of husband h u b a n d husband okay Okay. Um, Peter, what is husband? Husband is uh, the the man of wife. You're your father. Your father is the husband of your mom. Oh, I know. Yeah, and your mom is the wife of your father. Oh, you understand now? Oh, wow. I, I yeah, I like you, Anna, because you keep on asking. You have to ask me if there are words you did not understand. Okay. If you think okay. it's hard, okay, teacher Anne, what is this? What is this? So you can learn. Okay, very good. That's what I like to Anna. Very good. Okay, sorry, I forgot to give you the picture of Amy. Amy looks like you. And Amy also as funny as you. She is also smart as you. That's why I always keep on telling Amy Anna and you I said Amy. <laughs> Okay, here, let's have this number three. Okay, in here, Anna, you will have to listen and write a letter in each box. There is one example. This is about Alex, uncle, who loves taking photo with his new camera. Love to take photo. But where did he take each of the photo? Each of this photo, where did he take it? Okay, you listen and answer. Part three. 
listen and look. There is one example. Alex's uncle loves taking photos with his new camera. Where did he take each photo? Look at these, Alex. They're some photos that I took with my new camera. Oh, they look great. You are clever. <laughs> I took this photo of these flowers when we were having a picnic by the lake. We walked there on Sunday. We were on holiday there. Can you see the letter C? Now you listen and write a letter in each box. Where did you take this one? The one of the two men? Well, I met them last week. I went with them to visit an old village in the mountains. This is a photo of them back at our hotel in the city. They were on their balcony there. And look at this lovely swan, Alex. It's great. Your aunt and I were sitting by the river in town when I took this photo. It was very hot and sunny that day. We had lunch there. I enjoyed that day. I love this one. Why? Well, I'll tell you the story about this one. We were walking over a bridge on Thursday when suddenly this parrot shouted out, Hello! I quickly took a picture of it before it flew back into the trees. It had a very long tail. Wow! How exciting! You'll like this one too. All the others wanted to stay on the beach at the weekend, but I wanted to do something more interesting. I found a dark cave there and went inside. There were lots of bats there. Here's the photo that I took of them. Weren't you afraid? No. And what about this one? Hmm. I saw these strange insects on the rocks near a waterfall. Perhaps they liked the lovely cold water. It was another very hot day. I don't know what kind they are. Do you? No. But it's a great photo. They all are. Thanks, Alex. Now listen to part three again. Where did you take this one? The one of the two men? Well, I met them last week. I went with them to visit an old village in the mountains. This is a photo of them back at our hotel in the city. They were on their balcony there. And look at this lovely swan, Alex. It's great. Your aunt and I were sitting by the river in town when I took this photo. It was very hot and sunny that day. We had lunch there. I enjoyed that day. I love this one. Why? Well, I'll tell you the story about this one. We were walking over a bridge on Thursday when suddenly this parrot shouted out, Hello! I quickly took a picture of it before it flew back into the trees. It had a very long tail. Wow! How exciting! You'll like this one too. All the others wanted to stay on the beach at the weekend, but I wanted to do something more interesting. I found a dark cave there and went inside. There were lots of bats there. Here's the photo that I took of them. Weren't you afraid? No. And what about this one? Hmm. I saw these strange insects on the rocks near a waterfall. Perhaps they liked the lovely cold water. It was another very hot day. I don't know what kind they are. Do you? No. But it's a great photo. They all are. Thanks, Alex. That is the end of part three. OK, part three. OK, now, look at here. So we have here, Anna. OK, where are you, Anna? OK, you have here. There are different pictures. We have the flowers, we have the swans, we have the insects, the parrot, the bats, and the man. Okay. First is, where did he found the man? Okay, the picture of the man, it's letter F, it's in the balcony. Okay, 
What do you call these pictures? It's balcony. Okay. This picture, Anna, is called as a balcony. Another. Here. Okay. Next is this one. Where did this found this one? It's in the river. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, the river. Next is, after they find this one, they have this beautiful parrot. It's letter A. Where did they find it? Oh, it's near the bridge. It's under the bridge. bridge. There is a parrot. Oh, you know what is parrot? Yeah. Yes, that's the bird which has these different colors. Yes, um, I, I go to the mall supermarket and uh, they uh, have, have a pet, many pet, and I say, hello, 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 hello. <laughs> okay, hello. Is, it, oh, is it a parrot? Yes, it's a parrot. Oh, parrot is a beautiful bird with different colors. Next is Tang. Okay. After that, Uncle Alex went to the cave. Okay. Mostly, what you can find in the caves are the different bats. There are a lot of bats in the cave here. In the cave, you can find a different bats. Okay. There are different bats in the caves. Okay. Here. Letter H, okay, H, it's in letter H, there is a waterfall. There is a waterfall, okay, letter H, there is a waterfall. Okay, you can find there in letter H, the waterfall. Here, can you see that? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, it's the waterfall, okay. The, there, they found Uncle Alex take a picture of the insect in the waterfall. Have you? Uh, go to waterfalls. Um, yes. Um, okay. it's in, uh, I don't know how to say. Okay. It's, uh, there's a particular place in where it, there is a waterfalls. Mm, yes, it's a waterfall, but it's small. It's not big like a, it's not big. It's not too bigger. high. It's not too high. It's mm, um, it's smaller than this. It's like this. Ah, um, yeah. It's not too high. Where did you find it? Where did you find it? It's in? I find it in the forest. It's, I'm, go, uh, I'm going uh, to... To your grandma's um, house? No, 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 no. I'm going to uh, play in the forest. Oh, okay. Because in, in the forest in Vietnam, it don't have a lion, tiger, uh, a pig, uh, a bear, and oh. uh, it doesn't have but, lions, um, it doesn't have tigers, okay. It just, it just have uh, insects. Oh, it also only has insects. insects, okay, whatever is there, okay. But, of course, in the Philippines, we have many waterfalls. In our place, we have a very long waterfalls. We call it Can Omantad Falls. It's too long, but the water is not that clean. I don't like to go there, Anna. The water is not clean. Anna, in, it's uh, very in, far. Uh, in my uh, big park in Halong, um, I have a waterfall. Oh, but it don't have don't have water. Oh, that's the waterfall that don't have water. Oh my God! It's oh. like like this one, like this one. Okay, it's a <laughs> and uh, it don't have water. Ah, uh, it doesn't. It doesn't. Not don't. It don't. It doesn't have water. It doesn't have water. <laughs> and uh, it have have uh, waterfall. Yeah, it's waterfall, but it doesn't have water. Oh, what's that? It's a fake. It's yeah, a fake waterfall. A fake waterfalls. Okay. Okay, Anna. By the way, Anna, where are you in Vietnam? Where exactly are you in Vietnam? You're in Da Nang? How to put it in? I in Halam. Halam. Okay. Is it near Hanoi? It's mm, near, oh. but uh, quite far. Like, uh, you will we, have to ride a plane? We are in Halam, Halam here. Yes. It's me. And Hanoi is here. Ah, okay. So, quite far. 
we need to uh, to write a play to... no we don't need to we need to go with uh how many kilometers it's two kilometers oh not that far it's two kilometers yes. only yeah, yes. It's wow, so not that far. It's two kilometers only. Not that far. Okay, Anna. Okay. Now, Anna, you will have to listen and check this one. Please try to listen and check. Okay? I will just... Okay. Okay, I will just go downstairs. I will drink water. Okay? Please listen. Too, and... I, will, I will drink water too. Okay. Oh, we will drink water first. Okay, Anna. Okay, here. I will play and please listen. Part four. Listen. And look, there is one example. What time did school finish? Hello, Sarah. You're late. It's after seven. Well, I play tennis with Sue after school today. But school finished at half past three. That was a long tennis game. Well, we played until half past five. And then we went to Sue's house. We were very thirsty, and her mum gave us some lemonade. All right. But why didn't you phone us? Sorry, Dad. <coughs> Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. <coughs> One. Which is Sarah's favourite lesson? We had my favourite lesson today. What? <coughs> Art? No, that's not my favourite. Well, it was. Oh, I liked art when I was younger. But I prefer science subjects now. And geography. I love learning all about the world. That's the best subject. Two. Which girl is Sally? There's a new girl in my class, Dad. Her name's Sally. Is she nice? Very nice. 
and she's got lovely long hair. Well, your short hair is lovely too, Sarah. Yes, but Sally's hair is curly and mine's all straight. Okay. Okay, here. So we have here. This is the example. What time did the school finish? It's 3.30. Okay, that's correct. Number one, let us hear. Which is Sarah's favorite lesson? Okay, is it art class? It's science no. class or it's geography? The answer is... It's geography. It yeah. is geography class. Okay, here. Which is which girl is Sally? Okay. Um the one with is the one with um long, long and but it's curly, curly. Yeah, and curly. long black curly hair. It's a okay, it's a long curly black hair. Long curly black hair. This one let me say very good. Okay, here. Next one. Okay. Number three, listen. Three, which okay, wait for a while. I will erase. Team is Sarah in something excellent happened today. What I'm going to be in a big sports competition, it's for lots of schools. Great, which sports? Well, some of my friends are going to be in races or play volleyball. But I'm in the swimming team. Four. What did Sarah have for lunch? What did you have for lunch today? Burgers and french fries. Did you have any salad with that? Or fruit? No, I didn't. Sarah, you should always... Dad, stop, please. Five. What is Sarah going to do next? Well, what are you going to do now, Sarah? Are you hungry? No, I'm not. Can I have supper later? OK. Are you going to do your homework now? Did your teacher give you some today? Yes, she did. She gave us some geography and maths. OK. Well, you should do it now, I think. Oh, Dad! It's so hot this evening. I must have a shower first. I'll do my homework after that. Okay, again. Three. Which team is Sarah in? Something excellent happened today. What? I'm going to be in a big sports competition. It's for lots of schools. Great. Which sports? Well, some of my friends are going to be in races or play volleyball. But I'm in the swimming team. Four. What did Sarah have for lunch? What did you have for lunch today? Burgers and french fries. Did you have any salad with that? Or fruit? No, I didn't. Sarah, you should always... Dad, stop, please. Five. What is Sarah going to do next? Well, what are you going to do now, Sarah? Are you hungry? No, I'm not. Can I have supper later? OK. Are you going to do your homework now? Did your teacher give you some today? Yes, she did. She gave us some geography and maths. OK. Well, you should do it now, I think. Oh, Dad, it's so hot this evening. I must have a shower first. I'll do my homework after that. Okay, so we have here number one. Which team is Sarah in? Which team is Sarah in? Swimming, 
running or hmm. volleyball? It is swimming. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. Swimming. Oh, do you know how to swim? Do you know how to swim? Hmm. I, I don't know how to swim. I don't know how to my swim. My mom says, my mom said in some, uh, uh, my mom will teach me how to swim. Yeah, because also. Oh, also because, my daughter, Jillian, don't know how to swim. Okay. So be, why? Yes. Um, Because I, uh, the, um, the last year, um, in the, Summer, my mom want to teach me, but my mom is so busy, and oh. my mom can't teach me how to swim, and I know uh -huh. I don't know how to swim. Okay, what did Sarah have for lunch? Oh, do you like this? Burger and fries. Do you like burger and fries? Yes, I love, I love, I love. Okay, what is Sarah going to do next? What is Sarah going to do next? Okay. Sarah will take you will take shower. Shower. Of course, teacher. Yeah. Sarah will take shower. Okay. Before she will go into study, before she will eat, she will have to take shower first. Okay. So for now, let's move here. Okay. Very good. Anna. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Here. Look at this one. Okay. All you have to do is to lesson and color. Okay. I will erase first. You have to lessen and color this one. Part 5. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. Okay, are you ready? Shall we start? All right. Can you see the boy? He's riding a bicycle. Color his hat. What color shall I do it? Is purple okay? Yes, that's fine. Can you see the boy's purple hat? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and write and draw. 1. Can you see the woman in the picture? Yes, she's crossing the street. That's right. Can you colour her suitcase, please? Can I colour it red? I prefer brown. Oh, all right then. Two. Do you want to colour something else? Yes, but can I choose the colour this time? All right. Let's colour something on the ambulance. Can I colour its light <laughs> on the top of the ambulance? That will be good. What colour are you going to choose? Blue. Three. Would you like to write something now? Oh. Is it difficult? No, it's very easy. Can you see the shop? The one that sells books? Yes. Can you write books on the front? OK. That is easy. What next? OK, this time, can you colour something that the boy is wearing? His trousers? No, that will take too yeah. long. His scarf? Uh, yes, yeah. OK. It's so colour fast. it green. Why, why? Yeah, it's very fast. This uh, colour, lesson and colour, it's quite fast. Yes, okay. Okay. <laughs> Part 
Part 5. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. OK, are you ready? Shall we start? All right. Can you see the boy? He's riding a bicycle. Colour his hat. What colour shall I do it? Is purple OK? Yes, that's fine. Can you see the boy's purple hat? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and write and draw. 1. Can you see the woman in the picture? Yes, she's crossing the street. That's right. Can you colour her suitcase, please? Can I colour it red? I prefer brown. Oh, all right then. Two. Do you want to colour something else? Yes, but can I choose the colour this time? All right. Let's colour something on the ambulance. Can I colour its light? It's on the top of the ambulance. That will be good. What colour are you going to choose? Blue. The light of the ambulance is blue. 3. Would you like to write something now? Oh, is it difficult? No, it's very easy. Can you see the shop? The one that sells books? Yes. Can you write books on the front? OK. That is easy. Four. What next? OK, this time, can you colour something that the boy is wearing? His trousers? No, that will take too long. His scarf? Yes, OK. Colour it green. Five. Last one now. Can you draw well? I'll try. Can you draw an umbrella? Draw it in the woman's hand. OK. And colour it yellow. Yes, I can do that. Now listen to part five again. One. Can you see the woman in the picture? Yes, she's crossing the street. That's right. Can you colour her suitcase, please? Can I colour it red? I prefer brown. Oh, all right then. Two. Do you want to colour something else? Yes, but can I choose the colour this time? All right. Let's colour something on the ambulance. Can I colour its light? It's on the top of the ambulance. That will be good. What colour are you going to choose? Blue. Three. Would you like to write something now? Oh, is it difficult? No, it's very easy. Can you see the shop? The one that sells books? Yes. Can you write books on the front? OK. That is easy. Four. 
four. What next? OK, this time, can you colour something that the boy is wearing? His trousers? No, that will take too long. His scarf? Yes, OK. Colour it green. Five. Last one now. Can you draw well? I'll try. Can you draw an umbrella? Draw it in the woman's hand. OK. And colour it yellow. Yes, I can do that. That is the end of the Flyers' practice listening test, too. OK, here. So we have like this. What is the color of the woman's suitcase? Oh, it's color brown. Color the light on top of the ambulance. It's color blue. OK, the light. The one who moved like that. It's color blue. Write book on top of the bookshop. Yes, this bookshop. So therefore, there is the word books. Color the boy's scarf green. Oh, there's the scrap here. It's green. And draw an umbrella in the woman's hand and color it yellow. Oh, there's an umbrella. Okay. The umbrella, it's already open. Okay. <laughs> okay now. <laughs> the umbrella is open. Okay now. Okay. Anna, okay, I will be seeing you next class. Okay. okay when will it be? Teacher is very forgotten. It's on? Okay. Oh, I will see you on uh, Monday. 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 Yeah. Monday at 9 p.m. Teacher Anne will see Anna. Okay, Anna. Bye-bye, Anna. Thank you for today. Bye-bye. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.